today I'm going for a cooking class at homemade market so I'm going to show you what I'm going to make today and also the process let's go all right so that day I actually went to the wrong place but I'm just going to show you how you can get to homemade markets um, studio so you go to the first floor and it's on your left you pass through this um, hallway Afterwards, Nicole actually brought me to the live space where the cooking demo was um, held. This is the ingredients for the cookies. I'm gonna make this and this one as well. So this is the place where you will learn um, all the classes and then if it's a cooking class then the um, chef will stand over there then there's a TV right there as well to show all the students. Okay guys, I hope that you enjoy my homemade market uh, cooking demo. So homemade market is actually going to open up their studio on the 21st. So they will be holding like cooking classes, baking classes, arts and craft classes at their studio which is located at Sanctuary Mall, Kota Kemuning. So if you're interested to go to this kind of like classes, um, you can visit their Instagram page or Facebook page which I will link below and you know attend their classes now for today I actually ta -da, I actually fixed my iron previously it was like all black here and it yeah I don't know why it was black but it has been like that for a few years and I kind of tolerated it because it wasn't as bad but recently um, there was a lot of stains on my clothes that I had to like scratch out so it was kind of annoying me so I bought um, the like remover thingy basically you just have to use the cream to like clean it with a cotton like fabric until everything is gone so now it's like ah, usable again good morning everyone today i have these two huge old bananas look at how huge it is and i think i'm going to make pancake this oh oh no i hope this is still good i'm gonna make pancakes today so I don't have any eggs, so I'm going to try to make these banana pancakes without eggs. So just mash it all together. Some flour, some sugar. Looks like this. 
thing one is not enough. We're gonna add more. I'm gonna keep this. Just gonna put some flour. Okay, let's see if we can make this without eggs. This is my first time trying it. Okay. I'm not sure how am I supposed to do this. Can I just flip it? Oh, no. That's literally the best that I could do. Um, I used to make banana pancakes with bananas, oat bran, and egg and it tasted really nice if you put like peanut butter on top and extra bananas um, but for this one I don't know it just cannot stay that shape maybe I put too much right so this time I made the pancakes um, smaller and I hope that it will be easier to flip yes oh so cute now I'm going to put like this peanut butter on top of my pancakes. Just want to show you what it looks like because this is original peanut butter. Look at all the oil. <laughs> my friend says that this is not natural at all. There you go, banana pancakes with peanut butter. Hey guys, before I end this week's vlog, I just wanted to show you how I made um, curry with like some really old ass wrinkly um, eggplant or brinjal as you call it. So I basically just cubed all the um, eggplant and it looks still looks good I guess. And cooking. That's gonna be in here in a bit. Oh my god, just look at that. I also put cauliflower in the oven because this tastes really good with the curry. Dinner is served. So this is the roasted cauliflower and this is the curry with the eggplant right there. Mm.